Okay. <laughs> Hello and welcome everyone to another Mine Colonies Let's Play with the Developer Stream. And we are on a new world now. Now you just saw me throwing away my grave key because I spawned in lava as lucky I was in this new world. Um, so this is the new server. Um, this server actually just came online a few <laughs> minutes ago and we're going to see how things are turning out and are going to find a neat little spot for our colony. Um, some add-ons already logged in here. Yeah, let me come to you. Um, and of course, hi Superminix, hi Strotala, hi Misen, hi Margo. Hi, Minecraft Shirley. How are you guys? Okay, so Madden's is here with me. And we will have to find a nice place for a colony. But at the moment it's night. But I don't see any mobs, so that's kind of good, I guess. Did, did we spawn with food? Yeah, and some tools. Great, because I lost all of them. <laughs> I can give you some. Yeah, some food would be neat. Yes, nice. Um, yes, the, the spawn is currently getting set up by Kugo and Aravan, Aravan Fox. So those are going to build a amazing spawn for you guys. Meanwhile, we're going to start when wandering. I guess we should maybe get a bit of material and stuff before we start going. Yeah, so we don't die in the... Um, I don't know. I'm in a new graphics pa resource pack I'm trying out. But I'm not uh, completely set on it yet, resource pack. I'm using this Unity resource pack. We're going to see how that one is going to play out. Um, I want... <laughs> a leather spawning mob. No way! <laughs> Can I make tools out of granite? Is that useful? Granite? Don't yes! I can make a stone pick pickaxe out of granite. That's neat. Um, and I'm going to make a sword. And I guess... Ah, uh, you, uh, you got some tools already, right? Yeah, I've got tools. It's Those that I lost on spawning. <laughs> um, do we? You have a sword as well, right? You spawn probably. Yeah, everything. Great, everything but me. <laughs> um, I have no idea which mod that is that shows the durability of the tools. No idea. Um, I guess that's fine enough for now. We can start wandering a little bit around. Um, our newest updates are coming along quite nicely. Um, I was. Oh, I found string. Huh? You found ah, there's a bunch ah, string. Actually, it's a good idea to get that, right? Yeah. The string from those trees here, kind of useful, especially if for early on in the colony when we want a fisherman. A string is hard to get at the start. Yes, you are still on the server, surely. Um, and there's some string. There's uh, there seems to be a lot of string in generally in this world. I don't know what which biome are we in. What's the name of this biome? Oh, silk glade. Silk glade. Yeah. Ah, that's why there's it's a lot of silk. string because of it's silk glade. Found, I found a wild wizzy. A wild wizzy? Where? Yeah, here, up here. <laughs> no, I'm not AFK wizzy. Tell her it's... Should I give it some food? Maybe it follows us. Wissy, here. I have pork chops for you. Come, Wissy, come. <laughs> I, I did write him on on Discord. Um, join the voice channel, Wissy. So, so everyone can discover who the voice of the famous person we blame for everything is. How the voice of that person is. We blame for everything. 
Okay, he's going to come on voice. And going to be and he's going to be able to tell you guys yeah that is my grave you spawned on <laughs> exactly um teleport um minecraft surely to me there we go Um, yes, and those two are going to work on the spawn. And well, we're going to wait for Wissy to join in. And... Which... I, oh, I'm far away, yeah. You wanted to have some desert, right? Yeah. I think then we should go south. South? Okay, yeah. I was going north. <laughs> yeah, I'm not sure if you find some deserts there. Uh, did you did you search it or something like this? No, I tried out Terraforged World Gen and noticed that it's changes temperature only when you go south or north. Uh, okay. But this is a new update of Terraforged. Yeah, maybe it's a bit different, but Okay. So we are going south. I mean, um, at worst we get equal chances. And yeah. At best. Um, those look actually pretty amazing. I, I, I absolutely do love colonies on mountains as well. I did that in yeah, the I'm last I'm YouTube I'm series before the, the Twitch stream we made. Um, we had we were building a ah a skeleton. Not with me, pal. Are you already dying? No, I killed I a spider. A uh, spider. A uh, skeleton. Oh, I need to turn off auto jump. Okay. Yeah, I did the, fir the first thing I did before I did anything else. Before I asked myself why I sp just got killed by lava, I turned off auto jump. That was the first thing. <laughs> I think there was a fairly popular mod that was doing only one thing, and that was turning off auto jump by default. Much better. Yeah, auto jump is absolutely horrifying. I was thinking that I'm probably going to add to my um, mod that removes the annoying stuff. I was uh, the phantoms. I was thinking about making another mod that removes the wandering trader from the game as well. Hi, House of Dogs. How are you? Actually, uh, you can do that with the newest performance. I added some mob like this. Ah, you added a way to disable mod mobs yeah. types. Oh, that's neat. Okay, we are going further south. I do absolutely love those biomes. I definitely have yeah, to say. Yeah, I think the world turned out really nice. The world turned out pretty nice. <laughs> Don't remove the trader. Let the guards kill him. That's also an alternative. It's a bit more satisfying and less annoying, but more annoying. It's kind of the trade-off. You get, get free lead and leather. <laughs> and hi, Silent Souls. How are you? Um, I think Wissy didn't get his uh, mic to work yet. And hi, Tiny Tots. Thanks hey, for tuning in. Too fast. Everyone is lacking behind a little bit. Yeah. I think not yet. I think not yet. But that would be fairly easy to <laughs> to add to the list of things. I'm unsure, but I think there is actually even a config option. Oh, hi Ninja Chickmunk. Didn't I say hi yet? I'm sorry. Hi Ninja. How are you? Um, I was talking, some Adams was doing some work today and is getting, as far as I know, closer to 
getting some work on the tavern then, right? Yeah, I basically just need to do the guy stuff now. Um, so what he is actually working on, as far as I understood it, is the recruitment that is at the moment in the town hall is yeah. going to change significantly. It's kind of not very realistic, you just click in the town hall on the button and you get uh, a citizen. What's going to happen is that citizens are going to start appearing here and there in the tavern and for different recruitment costs uh, you can then right click them and hire them for your for your colony and besides that he's working on sitting in the tavern as well as far as i understood yeah so they are doing both so they're they also randomly appear in your tavern and sit around there or walk around and you can hire them basically so that's pretty neat Okay, a little village. That's usually a good start already. Getting some bads. Everyone mine a bad, people. <laughs> yeah, villages are always nice. And you have food and hay bales. Yeah, getting some hay bales already. That is a pretty neat start as well. Uh, these kinds of things we're also going to add in the future as well. Um quests etc are also going to come definitely to oh I have potatoes oh nice I mean use potatoes oh potatoes is going to be awesome <laughs> not only I but we're going to need the potatoes as well yeah. carrots nice so we got carrots and potatoes so we got basically everything for the healing of our citizens ready as well yeah so that's that's we're off to a good start i would say <laughs> um i was thinking the noise is as you but it's Rizzy trying to get his mic right <laughs> no it's Rizzy and it's <laughs> yes no it's not me it's Rizzy. how he always talks <laughs> Um. Oh. <laughs> I, I would say we can definitely blame Wizzy for his microphone not working. I think that one is definitely a safe one to blame. <laughs> um. Good. Here. Our oh, chest here. Dandelions, wax. Okay. Dandelions. No one needs dandelions. We do need dandelions because that's another thing you need to heal your citizens. Yeah, I know. It's always annoying because I never have it. <laughs> um, so the tavern is going to be fairly interesting in the future because it's going to be like a hub in the colony where you're going to be able to get quests and these kinds of things. Hi John, how are you? Um, Hi Snow, now get sick touch and take the beast along. Okay, um, I think we're pretty ready. Uh, maybe there's some more stuff in this direction. Some more hay. A Minecraft Shirley, I'm going to let you mine those. Yeah, this is the new Patreon server. Already. Okay, I'm going to leave one of these hay bales back here for the horse. Poor horse. I'm going to steal all its food. You know what? Free the horse! Free them for the horse! There we go. Um, no, it's, it's going to be accessible starting Friday. Um, we got currently... Kugo and Erevan setting up a nice little spawn colony and this one here is then going to be accessible starting Friday for everyone. Okay, see people already scavenged through this area here. Did they already enter this building? Yes, it's empty. So yes, Friday um, Mark it in your calendars, the server is going to be accessible for Patreons. Meanwhile, we are actually like something like pre-alpha testers now. So we're going to check if things are 
laggy or crashy or something like that to maybe be removed until Friday, right? <laughs> so Adam's already checking things. I'm already collecting a bunch of letters as well because I know that we are going to need that in the future. You already want letters? Wait a second. No, 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 not letters. It's leather. <laughs> okay. It makes the first item you get in this world. <laughs> <laughs> put put the letters into loot tables <laughs> as a 100% chance to find it in every chest. <laughs> yeah, or when breaking glass. Yeah, I definitely say um, when we get 35 subscribers, that's when we are going to get the next emote slot. The next emote is going to be letters. I think that one is already guaranteed. <laughs> Oh, we got a dark forest here. Um, although that's... Uh, is it warmer or is it colder? <laughs> oh, no idea. Good question. Ocean. Okay. Ocean is not bad. We will be able to take a boat, okay. maybe. Oh, I'm going to yeah. take one of these poppies as well. Because I know that oh. we're going to need them too. By any other name. No. And hi, Silent Source. Thanks a lot for your subscription. We really appreciate it. You got us like. It seems we got a new emote thanks to your subscription, so. <laughs> Double thank you on that one. So I'm going to try to get the letter emote until the next video. So that we got got that one going. Oops, that was a bit of rubber banding. And hi, Iris Chef, how are you doing? You seem to be lagging a bit. Yeah, I was. I'm lagging. Yeah. Okay, I'm I'm good now. Yeah, I th I'm I'm fine. I closed everything already before. No, no letters. <laughs> leather, leather. Yeah, that does. But the world looks absolutely beautiful, I think. That one we can definitely agree on. It took quite some effort to get Terra Force to actually not be completely flat. I think the new Terra Forge version now, we are on now. Like Wissy told me that this is the new Terra Forge version, is um, generating much nicer terrains as well. Okay, people, time to place our beds. Dipping in some field. How is this German music? I am about them corn found. Is Immer fry? <laughs> okay, we made it. Oops. We traded okay, beds. We beds. <laughs> <laughs> I guess I that works. <laughs> I guess I'm going to get a few more of those poppies. Oh yeah, so many. So many poppies. We're going to be crying later about not finding poppies. Especially since we're going to be in a desert. <laughs> yeah, and we should take some uh, tree saplings along too. Oh yeah, we should definitely get uh, take some tree sampling with, saplings with us of different oh. tree types. Oh. Um, so I was working um, today on, uh, let me drop off some of these things we don't need. Okay, dandelions I want, that, I got a pig head. Okay, never had that one before. Um, okay, that's better. Let me... Oak saplings should probably not be a problem, but when we find birch and these kinds of things. Yeah, that is a whole new... Um, yeah, that's, that's I think, a river here. Yes. Oh, I absolutely love those rivers. I hate those flat rivers in Minecraft Vanilla, but those rivers look just gorgeous. Oh, I love it. 
Oh, we got the nice little random thing spawning here. That's going to bring us a little bit of armor. And yeah, we got a pig's hat now. <laughs> okay, and uh, okay, now we go. Nice armor. Here, here, here. Um, and I'm going to mine, I guess, those am anvils. Anvils are pretty expensive. Oh, even iron ore. Nice, I got three anvils. There are more anvils. I got iron ore. Nice. Upstairs? Is there an upstairs in this one here? Ah, here. Yes, thank you. Um, bookshelves, I guess. Yes, thank you. I can already see our Patreons joining on Friday and the world is like completely mind empty. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Everything is plundered. Everything is plundered. Um, okay, my inventory is getting too full. What am I going to leave behind? Peanuts? That's fine. Um, you can give it truly, he takes it along. Okay. Um, does someone need some armor? Yeah. Here. Take those. Thanks. Uh, you guys will have to wait until Friday, yes. We're still kind of in the testing phase in these kinds of things, so... Yeah. Do I need to give wheat to a horse to tame it? Mm, wasn't this a head I Ah, no, I have to just sit on it, right? Yes. Oh, you got a saddle too. Right? I do have a saddle, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> God damn it. Nice. Saddle, armor. Go, horsey! <laughs> Two minutes in game. Oh, we have the horse and the saddle. <laughs> <laughs> that was a neat one. Oh, that one is going to be difficult. Oh, I jumped. Maybe there's another saddle in this one here. Yeah, might be. There might be another saddle there. Mine. Mine. Okay. Um, I'm going to start a third time. At this time, I'm going to finish my thought for sure. I promise. Um, I was working today on a bunch of exciting code and I, I, I would strongly believe you guys are going to love it. And like I was saying in the last stream yesterday, I started working on the builder prefetching materials into batches and that worked out pretty nicely. Um, then already yesterday I already started slightly having the builder pre-request parts of the items as well. And I got that one working pretty neatly today. And now I'm working on actually having the delivery men deliver more than only one. So basically the delivery man is going to be able to not only pick up a certain amount of stacks depending on the building level, but it's also going to be able to... Um, deliver several yeah the mod is coded in Java basically all Minecraft mods are coded in Java oh you got a, uh, a horse as well yeah oh neat and that was working pretty nice I ran into some little cavities and I found let's say a workaround that's not very beautiful and it's not go it's going to make it a little bit less efficient than it could be Yes, yeah, some mods use Scala and Kotlin, but as far as I got, Forge is deprecating all that Scala support stuff. Because that costs them like a third of their bandwidth. Are you further south? Yes. Even leaving shortly behind. There's no horse. Yeah, I'm getting some leather here, meanwhile. Leather, with uh, TH. Yeah, leather. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
And the problem is of the, of Scala is not that Scala is not like not that Scala is so huge, but it's like if you offer Minecraft and Scala, it's like twice, right? You have to offer the download for Scala and the download for for uh, for Java, and that's what makes it so huge, and that's why it's like a third of their bandwidth. So it's like enormous. Hi, Farrah Wolf. How are you doing? Oh, I, th I said I was waiting, right? I'm on the right side of the river, by the way. Yeah, I'm on the right side too. Okay, right great. Side, right. Um. <laughs> um. So I'm tr going to the initial version, like it is right now, is going to be great already. But I believe that the coming version I'm going to be working on is going to be pretty amazing. And it's going to be much better even. And I still just have to figure out some things with Orion about that. And yes, like John is saying, we're also going to rework... Players are not going to notice it actually, but... Yeah, the terrain looks amazing, I'd absolutely agree. This seems a little bit hotter now, the kind of meadows type. So maybe we can find some desert yeah. soon. You know, we're going farther away from spawn, right? Yeah, yes. Yeah, I was going to say how much, how far away do we want to go from spawn? Um, I gotta reload this. Oh no, that didn't... I... What the... Oh god. Did you fall down? I fell down! Don't believe it. <laughs> what else? First thing you do in the new world. Oh, that was impossible to see. That was absolutely impossible to see. Yeah, I nearly fell down as well. <laughs> Mind the gap, yes. Do you... <laughs> so how do you get your horse up again? Um, come horsey, we can do it. Just have to <laughs> mine stairs upwards. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> exactly that one. Exactly that one. <laughs> okay. No one saw that coming. Just you Ow. happen to do something. So like that. I, I just actually, I was just feeling pity of poor Shirley that we were leaving him behind, so I decided to give him a little bit of time. <laughs> okay, on the horse, mining is slower. So let me mine that off you horse. Off mining. Yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm doing that now. Okay. God, I need put some water bucket to make <laughs> space. Record my sc uh, scream for NPCs, yeah. That's definitely a possibility. I'm, ca I'm, I'm getting closer to the surface. Oh, it's getting dark here. I can't see things anymore. Um, can I get some... No? Is it getting dark outside? No. Just this tunnel? No, it's getting kinda dark outside. Not a lot, though. Yeah, kinda. Oh, nice, thanks. Yeah, that helps. Okay. See, that that's how much we love our horses. We're not going to kill the horse. To We're actually going to try to get the horse out of here. Poor horsey. Um, we got some pretty neat pl plans for spawn. I already spoiled it a little bit, but I'm not going to spoil it entirely. So you guys are going to have to be patient until Friday to see it. And sure, Margo, what are your questions about the server? Ask me. I can answer all the questions. <laughs> yeah! I made it! Hey. Um, how, how about... What is this? We go a little bit east now. No, west is this. West, yeah. Let's do west and after a while we can go north again. Yeah, exactly. So we aren't getting this far away. You will have yeah. to suffer finding it, Margot. <laughs> we are already quite far away, I think. 
Yeah, we, we walked around 5,000 blocks, so yeah. And second, how much health my horse has left? I only lost three hearts, that's not so bad. Yeah. Oh, surely he's getting close. Did he get a so uh And that is Terraforge Craft, the terrain mod. Um, Wissy set up our server. He did all the setting of the server stuff. Wissy sets up all our mod packs and servers. He's our mod pack server and blaming guy. Multitasking. Yeah. Yes, it will be not one person sleeping, but we got a sleep vo <laughs> yeah, blaming. We got a sleep voting mod in it. So if enough people sleep, um, we're going to skip the night. Although, if you think like, ah, and what about my citizens? It has been working fairly fine, this system on the Patreon server, on the Tech Colony server, where people have uh, regularly been asking around uh, about, uh, can I sleep or does anyone need their citizens to get to sleep first? And I think that's a neat way to promote people working together too. Oh, do you have um, bird saplings, by the way? Some add-ons? Yeah. Did you get bird saplings already? No, I'm getting some spoos now. Okay, um... I think only by destroying the leaves I should get already saplings, right? Yellow autumn sapling. It doesn't matter, it doesn't have to be spru... Uh, it doesn't have to be... Exactly. Birch, right? Can be one of the generated trees as well. As long as it's birch wood. Hi, Captain Salt. How are you? There's probably not going to be a lot of raids today, though. Okay. Did you also reach the river? No, which river? <laughs> There's in the east, in the west, a big river. I was about to say you went east now. No, 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 um, yeah. We might have to find a way to, to cross that. Oh, I absolutely love those chasms with the river flowing through them. I'm going to build a little bridge for us. Oops. Can we swim? Yeah, it's going to be difficult with the horrors, right? Yeah, as I can. That should be fine, right? Uh, one block bridge. Um, here we go. I can do it. I can. Yes, I did it. Let's see, hey. Minecraft Shirley. Is he coming running, or did he get a horse? No, he has one. What happened to? Ah, he's running. <laughs> poor guy. What happened to your poor colony, Captain? Tell us all about it. Okay, I guess we're going to get a bit north to go around that mountain. This is a very nice mountain. Yeah, let's get a go around it rather than over it. We said we wanted to go a bit north anyway. On top. But it's a neat mountain, definitely. So yeah, this uh, this stuff is going. My colonies is progressing very nicely. I think this uh, update about the prefetching etc. is going to be pretty awesome for the crafters because it's going to be uh, allow you to prefetch the things through the crafters basically. Oh, you got even golden armor for your horse. That's fancy. Yeah, surely found. Ah, surely found. You should put the medieval alternate alternate town hall on top. Yeah, that would fit pretty neatly on that mountain, wouldn't it? Yeah. You can even hear the wind. I guess Wissy forgot worded it. Do we need worded it? Playing Wissy. I got another go. Hey, they, they need worded it for the... I requested it. You can check the messages I sent you. I did request it. <laughs> Structurize I, does a bunch of the things already, though. Yeah, it should be able to. You can scan stuff. Oh, wow. 
Yeah, it's the ambient sounds mod. And oh wow to Captain Salt. His, his world got corrupted completely. That's always a pain. Because a colony corrupting you can recover from simply reloading the colony. But the world corrupting itself from Minecraft, that's a bit tough to recover. Oops. To reload some chunks. Meanwhile, we are still searching. Okay, this is getting tropical, so that's getting hotter, definitely. Yeah, that's nice. No more cold step. Um, we probably want to get some... Lush quest. Some jungle... Um, saplings. No, oh, no, right. not lemons. I want jungle saplings. Oh, that's oak leaves. Darn it. I'm gonna check if I find some cacao. Oh, caco cacao, that's also nice. Yes, definitely. Okay. Cashew, no. That's oak. Mm. Oh, I found some. Jungle saplings? Not nah, cacao. Cacao? Cacao? Also. Uh, cocoa. Cocoa. Let me get down. Didn't I get any jungle saplings really? That's a pain. Here. Further to the west. Yeah, the terrain is pretty neat. But yes, the terrain absolutely looks amazing, I think. The Terraforge mod. I talked once some months ago with the guys working on the Terraforge mod, and they have similarly ambitious goals as we do in Mine Colonies. Um, so they want, like, basically rewrite how Minecraft works itself. And biomes and terrain generation is basically the first part of it. So like, I think that's probably an interesting project to look forward to. Did you go further? Yeah, I'm still going west. Okay, me too. This is some funny blue biome. Yeah, yeah, we have um, biomes or plenty mixed with Terraforge. A bunch of people told me they fit together very nicely, so that's what we did. Even though it seems deserts get a little bit more difficult to find. But that's probably just because we have Murphy with us. But yeah, it's, it absolutely looks amazing. I think that's something we can take away from this already. If there's no deserts, we need to make a new seat. <laughs> <laughs> okay. At least we got a little bit closer to spawn now. Yeah, but we don't use... Uh, <laughs> another week to get another seed. Yeah, Wizzy is quite dedicated when it comes to seeds and he tries out a bunch of different ones until he finds one that really looks nice. Yeah, sometimes it's Did just... You down again? No, no. I'm fine, I'm fine. What is this? Spruce? Yeah, I absolutely love those biomes. Yeehaw! <laughs> nah, that world is going to stay. There's going to be uh, some desert somewhere, we just gotta find them. We're going further south, I believe. I guess I have, will have to build, do I have some bones with me? No, do I have a few bones? 
Could get some dogs. No. Maybe okay. we could wait till it's night and kill some skeleton. <laughs> yeah, but if we randomly teleport, we're going to lose our horses. And I'm going to die in lava. <laughs> Guaranteed. I'm going to die in lava. Okay, we gotta sure. we gotta sleep. Um, I'm unsure if we added a nature nature's compass. See, twenty five one percent sleeping is not enough. Need some add-ons to go to sleep too. Like I explained it earlier, nature's. No, compass, ender compass, soul compass, no nature's compass it seems. Where's my horsey? There we go. Wait. This direction, right? Oops. I got stuck in the tree. Still no. There's a lot. I think we, sh we should. I don't know. We can get Vikings here. <laughs> yeah, we can get Vikings in this one here. It's getting cold as well. Let's try to cross oh, no. the river here. Yeah. And maybe a bit of. Oh, it's getting an ocean here. That might be a good idea. Maybe we get our horse in a boat. You can get a horse in a boat, can't you? Mm, not sure. I think there was something. Did you go further south? I thought we are going north. No. Yeah, I was going a bit further south to see if the if there's a way over, but there is not. So we need to build a little bridge. Uh, I just swim through. That worked fine with the horse. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I'm going to try that then too. If it's not going to work, I'm going to blame Wizzy. Okay. Okay. I think we made it. <laughs> See? Even though I was kind of underwater walking with the horse, it's kind of weird as well. Yeah, me too. But yeah, those biomes look absolutely amazing. I love it. Terraforge fits very well with mine colonies. I think that's something we all can agree on. Also, I wouldn't want to build in the snow stuff. Imagine yeah. you have to to clean it all up. Yeah, it, building in the snow is maybe not the best thing. Yeah, I was also expecting the horse to kick me off, honestly, John. I also didn't get it why it didn't, but I'm happy it didn't. Yeah, this is the new um, developer server. However, starting Friday, this server is going to become the um, new Patreon server as well. Wait, mind the gap. Take care, come here to the shore. Or are you going to fall into the oh, ravine? I fell down. <laughs> he fell down, really? <laughs> God damn it. So, we lost uh, some addons down in the ravine. Hi. <laughs> Hi. Uh, I... I, um... Okay. Can you switch? You're, you're mining in the wrong direction, pal. You're mining up the river. You have to mine in this direction here. Yeah, but maybe my horse can swim up. Your horse can swim up upstream? Okay, I'm, sure. I'm going to leak some water in here from the top and we're going to see if your horse and is I going try. to... <laughs> huh? And I try it. Okay. Against. Horsey, don't, don't do <laughs> stupid things. <laughs> Stay uh, away from uh, the ravine. Okay. Not working. Work. <laughs> yeah, I guess so. 
I suppose so. Okay. I I mine my way up. So you gotta mine your way up, the traditional way. And we give we give Minecraft Shirley some time to walk to us. I, I guess he totally lost that. I'm going to teleport him. I think he ah, he's he crashed. Okay. Point. When you when you go come back on, I'm going to teleport you to us. Um, you're already. Okay, I can see you. I found some mini cave. Here. Oh. <laughs> giving some can can horses go up ladders no but that's a neat mod idea <laughs> that's a neat mod idea okay you need a two tire two by two yeah and got up in some more I don't have a shovel with me John that's why I'm I'm not using one <laughs> they aren't Skyrim horses, <laughs> aren't they? Aren't you horsey? A Sky? I definitely know that this horse. I don't know. It doesn't laugh. It's alive because it's hanging around that ravine. <laughs> Pegasus horses, flying horses. I, I guess that would be a nice mod idea as well. Flying horses. Hi, Kaluki. How are you? I guess flying horses is better than creative flight. And now you won't fit through it. Damn it. <laughs> Too lazy. <laughs> hey, I'm already mining halfway through here. Come help me quickly and we get your horse out. Okay. I found some coal. I guess it should be fine now. It should be enough. Yeah. Horsey, no! Yes, the horse's okay. name is Horsey. This horse loves to hang out next to the ravine. It, fl it jumped down once and I thought it was an accident. I definitely believe it was on purpose. And it's like it's like a lemming horse. It's because it's your horse. <laughs> <laughs> it's my horse. It's like the uh, how the uh, I don't know. Isn't there a thing like that in English as well? How the owner so the pet. Not sure. I know in German there is. I'm not even know how it's in high German. It's like Wies Herrlich so Schelle. But is there some in, in high German for that? That's supposed to be German. <laughs> yeah, it's South German. <laughs> ah, so not German. <laughs> Dogs look like they're people. So horses look like they're people. Yeah. I, I like my South German version. <laughs> Okay, it's it's getting colder and not hotter. <laughs> yeah, but at least the climate cha climates are changing. So yeah, from from normal to cold and back. <laughs> uh oh, I think that's a bad idea. Horsey, I'm going to destroy a little bit of that ice here. Okay, this time we can do it. Yes, <laughs> we, we found a snow desert. That's a, that's a fitting description as well. <laughs> and a second river, are you kidding me? Oh, wait, check this here. What? We found a waystone. Ah, waystone. Ah, neat. Did you activate it? Yeah, you need to right click it so you can get out to it later. Added waystone. Nice. 
Yeah, we did add the waystone mod. Okay. So it's getting warmer now with Taiga and we don't have any snow left. What is this? Yeah, ta Taiga is very warm. Very warm? Hey, we're Germans. <laughs> it's warmer than Canada, so it's warm. There we go. Uh, um, dum -de -dum. It's still no desert though. Although it's getting warmer now. I'm seeing some more warmer colors at least, it seems for me. Yeah. La la la. Maybe we see turned off deserts. <laughs> we see turned off deserts just to. Well, they can to mess set with us. Temperatures at the Terraforge World again, and you can set min and max temp. <laughs> Don't tell anyone. <laughs> yeah. We know you, Wizzy. We know you. Um, Shirley's back. There you come. I guess if we aren't finding a desert at all, we may actually need to fortress style. I think if we don't find a desert, I would rather try the the Asian style. To be oh, fair. Asian is quite true. Cool. Cool. Um, that... Nah, um, don't listen to where he is dying. There is a desert? Okay. No, 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 he's just saying that to confuse us. We're getting closer to spawn anyway. <laughs> we walked away far away from spawn and we're getting closer to it. So we're going just to, to see. Just to find the desert. Like <laughs> just to find this bad that desert to <laughs> close to this one. That that would be sick. Um yes, we have um skin packs planned for more diverse versions. However, yeah, we need someone to make them, right? We we need an artist to make it. We're planning on it. But before we have an artist that actually makes it. Yeah, I gotta sleep, right? There I go. I'm sleeping. Go away from the zombies quickly. <laughs> oh, I just heard a, a creeper. Okay, we are going. But at least we are finding, we are loading a bunch of chunks. So that this is less chunks to generate later. <laughs> for <laughs> And we're testing out things because that's usually when you see things crashing when they generate in the generate in the world. And yeah, at least work and stuff. Um, at least work and stuff, and none of it is crashing. So that is pretty good sign already, I would say, for the stability. And it's loading quick enough as well. So yeah, it's loading quick enough as well. Yes. Maybe we see flu already here. Oh. Yeah, that's unlikely. Um, now maybe he always checks out 10k chunks. Yeah, this is going to be the server. Hi, Vets. Yeah, this is going to be the server where developers are going to play. Uh, developers are playing together. Yes. Also, a short shout out for Bisect Hosting that are actually giving us the server for free with 10 gigabits of RAM. So that's pretty neat as well from them. Yeah. Yeah, it will open on Friday for all Patreons. At the moment it's closed for developers and um, spawn builders. Okay, this here is one of these warmer, like we got very warm biomes now. This kind of is starting to look like we're getting close to a desert. Um, it's yeah. because the spawn has to be built and we don't want you guys on a... And we want it to be tested a little bit. This looks like desert! 
<laughs> I'm excited. This looks like desert. Doesn't this look like a desert? Doesn't um, it? Xeric Chaplin. Yeah, it, it has sand. It's a desert. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think we even can get desert raiders here. Yeah, and it's too slow, uh, too small as well. Yeah, it's, it's already like ended. A, already like ended. Warm patch. And we're going to build in the Space Wars theme, actually, our colony. So that's going to be interesting. No one likes that one. We see cheating again. Yeah, we see that is pretty much in the direction we are heading. <laughs> Funny enough, that's exactly the direction we're heading. Yeah, okay. I definitely love this climate zone here, though. Come, horsey, you can do it. Yes. Okay, no, you couldn't. Go here and land, come. Here. Come. There we go. What are you trying there? Um, yes, your own roads you can use on any server. There's no restriction. Come, horsey. You can do it. You can do it, horsey. <laughs> Wrong direction, horsey. Ah! Oh. Okay, there's some add-ons. I got it. I got it. How long before Ray kills the horse? We fell down pretty steep mine shaft already, and the horse is fine. So we're we're doing good. We even built up um, holes for the horse to pass. Yes. So we that are taking care then. very well of our horses. Very well. This one might be already. I think that is the the desert Wissy was talking about. Maybe. Nah, no, this is four k four k blocks away. We are at minus x. Ah, it was plus. Mm -hmm. But this plus looks eight. pretty neat. But it's too small as well. It's not that small. But yeah, the sides aren't. Yeah, it's it's very thin, right? It's pretty yeah. long. But, but I like the mountain one, since <laughs> a, a, more. A, a nice mountain for Chabis Palace, <laughs> definitely. <laughs> it's at least more interesting to build on a mountain than on a flat ground. Yeah. Uh, let's see, we're going to follow this a little bit. How big is it here? It's going to end. Let's see, I'm going to mark this here on the map. Okay, J, I'm going to remove my death point. New first kinda desert. Yeah, it's kinda. Oh, I can see surely on the map. <laughs> <laughs> He's getting there. He's, he's coming. <laughs> he's coming. Eventually he's going to reach us. <laughs> it's like so it's, um, slow but steady. Yeah. The What is it? The steady horse wins the race, right? Yeah. That's what. But I definitely love those these biomes here. They look much more natural than those vanilla biomes that are like so black I and know. white. If we find red sand. We mine all of it. <laughs> if we find red That's sand, cool. yeah. We're going to go to the end just to get sugar boxes to fill them up. <laughs> yeah, he doesn't have... <laughs> yeah, the steady horse wins the race, but how is he going to win the race without a horse? Yeah. There we go. He doesn't have a, a saddle, that's the problem. We were lucky enough to get two of them. Yeah, there were two spawn tower houses. Oh, 
Oh, there is a, a little city here. Hey, I believe we can find a, a nice saddle here for... And take it with us. For Minecraft Charlie. This looks neat. Honeycomb. That's good, I guess. I'll take it. Um, yeah, those I don't need. Um, dirt I don't need. Shears is good. More honeycombs. Fine. Wags. Oh, more honeycombs. <laughs> Mm, honey comes. Oh, dandelions, nice. Oh, double click on chest items in a chest to pick up all. Yeah, that worked. Didn't you know that either? I, I kind of, I kind of did, but I always forget about it. <laughs> I couldn't find a saddle though. Yeah, I mean. Not We're sorry, Shirley. Maybe no, it's uh, no saddle for you. Nope. The shears were useful at least, though. So. Oh, there it's getting warm as well. I'm seeing one of these desert tea biomes again. I can do it, horsey. Yes, we did it, Horsey. No, we didn't. Okay. There we go. Okay. Is this... I think this is looking like a desert. We even have a desert ruin here. Let's just check how big this is. Mm, doesn't look big enough, though. Although, I guess at least we could get a... Maybe it's big enough, though, to be honest. Is it? Nah, a bit too small. Let's go into the temple and get, um, surely, a saddle. Yeah, I also thought so. Who jumps down? Oh, wow, I almost fell down. <laughs> Do treasure plates get triggered by items falling on them? No. Only golden okay. ones. Would, would already have ex exploded them. Um, do you have a torch or so? Yeah. Can you place it? Okay, that's better. Okay. Save now. Save. Oh, supply camp. <laughs> nice. <laughs> okay. Um, what do we have? A golden horse armor. Uh, Morgani Morganite. Black lotus. Silent gems. Are those things good? I don't know no how idea. silent gems works. People tell me what I'm supposed to pick up here. <laughs> Oh, diamond horse armor. Yeah, that one I should pick up. True. Um, gunpowder, no. What is this? Alexandrite? Is this good? I guess not bad, maybe? Maybe. What is this? Britite. Citronite. I think we're fine. We can go up. Well, let me just get the... Um, Okay, we can go back up. 
Did did we get a saddle? No, right? No. <laughs> that is that is bad luck. <laughs> No, oh, but we found Shirley. <laughs> yeah, Shirley found us. <laughs> Shirley found my horse. Okay. Um, diamond armor. Fancy. Did, do I have tallow? Oh, I have tallow. I didn't even see that I was having this tallow. Yeah, this this is going to be pretty nice. I'm pretty psyched as well, playing with you guys. Um, here's this is is nice. Oh, oh, this is next to a mesa biome we have to build here. Next to a what? Mesa biome. Ah, nice. Wet, which has some wet sand. Um. Oh, nice. Yes. I think this is a quite nice spot. I think it's a pretty neat spot, definitely. With a river and such. And is here red sand at all? I can't find any red sand. I'm not seeing any. Normally it's at least close to it, but maybe if Terra washes a bit different. Oh, there is a waystone. Oh, here's red sand. Yes, look at this. Red sand. Oh, nice. <laughs> we are rich now. It's <laughs> we are more rich worth. now. <laughs> it's more worth than toilet paper. <laughs> <laughs> it's it's the toilet paper of, uh, of Minecraft during. Um, I guess I guess yes. We could see if maybe on the other side of this mesa biome we're going to find another desert because it's a s similar climate zone, right? Yeah. But else we could stick to the other side. <laughs> Um, where is also a, a neat little river going through the middle of the colony? Um, we aren't that far from spawn. I yeah, know. we're pretty getting pretty close from spawn. And this oh, mesa biome, bad. this red sand biome is huge, by the way. Yeah, it's a very big red sand desert. I mean, you wanted a desert. <laughs> <laughs> Another waypoint. Okay, here the the desert is ending. So let's go north. And see how the things are turning out around here. Uh huh. Yeah, this mesa is huge. Oh, there's some building over there. Some what? Some building over here. Is there maybe a shadow for Minecraft early? Stay tuned to find out. <laughs> oh. Seems to be like a bigger cathedral or so. Oh yeah, that looks interesting. And I saw there were a bunch of um, armor stands in this one. Let's see if we can find here a saddle. a saddle for Shirley. Then we only have to find a horse. <laughs> okay. Oh, they are sent. Nothing here. Oh, nice! Some protection leggings. Yeah. Iron horse armor. Oh, nothing. Only that. That's neat. Do you put wet sand into the chest? Yes. Oh, a bucket. 
Yeah, this looks pretty neat though. It goes up here. There are a lot of rooms. With a lot of armor stands. This is the boss room. Oh yes. More bookshelves. Um I is found a saddle. You found a saddle? Yay, we yes. got a saddle for you! <laughs> Oh, I found a crossbow. Um, what don't I need here? This here I don't need, this here I don't need. Put on some enchanted iron boots. Does someone else need armor still? I got um, a bucket, maybe. Better than nothing. I think I'm going to take this crossbow with me instead of the melons. Um, surely did not catch up yet, right? Not yet. He has a saddle. You found one too, or did I? Uh, or maybe he just saw the stream. <laughs> okay, I got one on one of these towers here. Ouch. Who oh, I could do it! That was a good jump. I'm not so bad in, in parkour afterwards. Ah, oh, you nice, fun. you found one too. That's neat. So why do, did I take this one now? <laughs> <laughs> Anybody needs it? Hey, yeah, it's Valhelsia structures, adding those structures here. Yeah. Um, I think none of these things. I think we're fine. So now, now surely only needs a horse. Okay. I'm sure he finds some in the desert. <laughs> <laughs> so we, we, there's another structure over there. You can keep it for Wizzy. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I can probably leave those behind too. Um, where in the, which direction was the desert again? We want to go back into the warm biomes, right? Uh, so. So let's go west here a little bit. Dum -de -dum. We could also check out uh, this is desert. Yeah, it's getting we're getting pretty close. Although it would be now. We Pretty much the direction we're going, right? Quite a bit. Was it? And north, east, we gotta go. No. Plain north. Uh huh. -huh. Is that what I'm seeing there? A waypoint or a cactus? Stay tuned to find out. It was a cactus. <laughs> Another village. But we, we have a waypoint near this for the red sand, so this is going to be good. Yeah, that's nice. We can craft some as well. Oh, there's another colony, uh, another village here. Pretty close to our town then. Meow. I heard a cat. You can tame it and then one fifteen. Um what do you mean with reset um reset the colony? Do you mean Delete the colony, or do you mean like reset it somehow? And um, this is the um, Unity texture pack I'm trying out right now. I got other texture packs I wanted to try out too, but this is taking ages to reload each texture pack. That's why I didn't do it yet. 
We just oh, only some more. Yeah, it looks it looks quite neat. I might um, just stick with this one here. We'll try the other one, maybe another episode, and then we can decide which one we're going to stick with. Actually, yeah. There are a lot of mountains here. At least the the heat settings actually work. <laughs> Wizzy legs backpacks, I guess. Mm, they are very useful. You can store letters and send it. You can sell all this with sent on eBay. And <laughs> um, you might want. Ow, ow. You might want to try to execute the um, load colony comment. I think that might fix it for you. Oh, I actually absolutely love this mesa front here. Yeah, me too. This looks so much better than the vanilla mesa. <laughs> Like, why is it like this? Why is everyone better at everything than Mojang? <laughs> <laughs> Good question. Oh, there's some desert over there. Is there? Yeah. Okay, I'm going there in this direction too then. Yes, I did save the location of the other desert we saw earlier. Yes. Yeah, we can do a massive colony as well, but I would prefer making a Space Wars colony. I always wanted to make one of those. Okay. How does this desert look? A little bit oasis-like? But it seems relatively big, isn't it? Yeah. That could be just the size we we need, right? Yeah, it's definitely the right size. It's a uh, very big mound, kind of. Going to go a little bit to the right. You're going to... you're going... Oops. How is the health of my horse, by the way? It's fine, okay. Okay, here's a relatively big river through the desert. Let's be, it's a neat point as well. Yeah. Also the other one had a river too, I think. Yeah, but it had a smaller river. This one here gets fairly large on one side. Yeah, if, if anything, we would definitely build it around the river, yes. It's usually a very neat way to travel in Minecraft is with a boat. <laughs> um, yeah, I think this could be a very good starting point for our colony. Did you cross the river? No. Ah, if I'm seeing you. Ah, there is a little lusher biome on the other side. Yeah. Oh, I found a waypoint. Oh, neat. Um, I guess this is a cr great place for a colony. Would we want it to have it like here, closer to the mountain, or... Let's maybe go a little bit more here to the right and see how... Yeah, I'll walk along. Oops. Would be neat if he had some water for pirates. <laughs> oh, kinda had enough of pirates, to be honest. <laughs> to be honest. 
<laughs> but if we go down a little bit the stream, there is enough water for pirates, to be honest. Ah, see. So we have to go there. Yeah, I guess I guess this this is where we're going to settle, I would say. So we actually did it and yeah, need a little bit longer than an hour actually to to find this place here. We are in an hour and twenty minutes. But it definitely looks like a neat spot to start a colony. Um So who's going to wall our mountain? Um, yeah, the question is, are we going to go around here, next to the mountain? I actually do like when the terrain is not too flat. Or we go here in the terrain where it's a bit flatter. That's also... Yeah, or like half-half. Yeah. Um, where the river is a little bit thicker, it has a chance of um, spawning pirates in it, though. Yeah, small chance. Um, let's. This is says we need to check his place too. We could check the other side as well. And we can check the other side too. That's true. Okay, horsey. Come. Can do it. You can do it. Made it. Yes. Oh, there's another waste point. So yeah, here here the river gets a little bit bigger. Okay, this is a very large desert. It yeah, th this is a very desert. large desert. And we have some water here. Yeah. So for example, here, if we build, could build some nice bridges over the. Now now here it opens up completely, to, kind of sea-like thing, right? Or now it's a huge so river. The sea is nice. And we can have a fisher here and maybe a ship. Mm -hmm. So that's also a possibility. Although it does, it looks a bit more bland here. Yeah, it's more flat. It's a bit too flat for my taste. Looks a bit boring. Oh, surely got a uh, horsey now too. Nice. Oh, there are some mountains. Let's see. <laughs> There's some nice deserty mountains here too. Horsey, go up the mountain. Yeah, up the mountain we go. Yeah, we do need it a bit flat at least because. A bunch of the buildings are somewhat underground, yes. Like, that here is too mountainy, definitely. Yeah. How? Yes. If then I'd build it's a, a downside of a mountain. Yeah, next to the mountain, but not... And there here it goes down the mountain as well. Yeah. Um, how does it look like here? Could have it like next owl. Could have, for example, it here, right? Like, like here, for example. And that does look like a neat spot, I have to say. Yeah, and so we do not have a river here. We do not have what? We have no river. Yeah, we have no river, that's the only thing. Let's go a little bit more in this direction, but I do like this spot here. I'm going to note this down as well. New possible desert colony. Oops, that we are starting early. <laughs> um, oh, yes, see, um, do you think nice. do you think the spot you found looks better than the spot we found here? The spots we found here. We see things, yes. Damn it. Right. 
Um, yeah, it's, it ends here, right? Yeah. It ends on to a ocean. And river. Yeah, I'm, I'm feeling really bad for hurting Horsey on the cacti. Let's sleep quickly again. Yeah, deserts are boring, but you can make deserts look amazing if you build the right structures in it. That's the thing of deserts, right? Um, so, uh, Wissy, can you share with me a uh, waypoint to the place you are? We're not cheating, we're not going to start teleporting around. And I'm, I don't want to lose horsey either. You click J, click on the waypoint. Ah, there he did. Um, save. Um. Oh, he sent it before. Ah, there, desert. It's in this direction. Six thousand blocks only. <laughs> Good that we have. Horses. Good that we have horses. And 6,000 blocks, that's, that's less than we walked today already, anyway. But this looks like a neat spot as well. It's yeah, a bit yeah, this is very nice as well. But it's not enough desert here. No, you can't make full desert here. Yeah, this is <laughs> that fireworks to the horse? That, lo that sounds kind of cruel. Um, why did the minimap close? You hit some hotkey. What is the hotkey? Yeah, stream 10. What? Stream, tell me. What is the hotkey <laughs> for <laughs> reopening the mini? It's like, like a uh, wiki to it, ask. It, it's like, hey Siri. It's of a hey stream. Yeah. How is the... Three? No. I tried three. Desert. Ouch. Sorry, horsey. Oh, sorry. Number pad three. I don't have a numpad. I'm on a laptop doesn't work either. M? No. <laughs> A? A? No. W? K? N? No. K? N? I? J? 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 No. Just play with map for the rest of this world. Nah, this is terrible. Alt F4? Definitely Alt F4. Definitely Alt F4. I'm 100% sure. Thanks a lot. This is going to help me out. One second. <laughs> I, O, no, none of these. Only 5,000 blocks left now. We're getting closer. Yeah. Um, the key bindings. Options, controls. Uh, um. Corail, crafting, crafting, inventory sorted, journey map, change map type, E, none of those.
Control. Yes! Control J! <laughs> How did you accidentally hit that? Good question. Next question. Okay. I'm seeing Shirley hanging around here a little bit. Desert, 5,000 blocks away. Doesn't Minecraft have some auto walking? So you don't have to press a button all the time. Yeah, at least a horse could have like you. Yeah. Oh, you have to message me on Discord, and I can give you the Patreon perks uh, on Discord then. What is the recipe for a backpack? Quark, backpack, quark, leather, wool, and string. I don't have wool. I have string. I have string too, I don't have wool. Oh, there are sheep here. And I have... A shear? A shear. But you don't have four. Now I have. Okay, I'm there. It looks nice. Are you there? I don't believe it. <laughs> no. 4,000 <laughs> blocks, yes. 4,000? <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, if oh, I have I enough string it. I can make wool, that's true. But I don't want to waste all my, all my string on wool though. I'm going to get a bunch more wool here on the way. Pick it up. Pick, pick, pick it up. There we go. I found some bamboo. Bamboo? Neat. Yeah, here's a jungle biome. So we're progressing here. Oh. But it's still all the entire strip here seems to be um, warm biomes. Seems like an entire hi Tylee. Yes, we are on the new Patreon server that's going to open up on Friday, and we are exploring here a little bit and trying to find a colony place for us. We already marked two on the map. We're going to try out the third one, Wizzy found. Yeah, it seems kind of like the equator, yeah. And it's east, and it is east-west. That could actually be correct. Thinking about it, that could actually be like the equator here. Yeah, Terraforge keeps kind of the same temperature when you go east-west or west-east. Okay, four thousand blocks. Oh, I see you. Was that you? No. Yeah. Yes, I had it to was build here. A bridge here. Okay, some items build a bridge. I did it. Hey. Did you get some cocoa, by the way? Yeah. Did you get some jungle saplings as well? No, I don't have a jungle sapling. Okay, let's Do make you? a short break here. And I can make us backpacks, probably. I think I have enough material to... Can you craft a crafting bench for us? Uh, no space, but yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we are, we are getting there. Crafting bench. Um, backpack. Okay, I got a backpack. Medium backpack. And I got a medium backpack. And I got a large backpack. And how do I use it? Ok, 
Can I just drop items inside? No. Do I have to put it on my chest? No. You right, right click it and then... Ah, that worked. Okay, that is a lot of space. Nice. <laughs> All that stuff that I was not using. Oh, this is so, <laughs> so nice. <laughs> now I got a lot of free space in the inventory. We get some wood and an axe then. There we go. And an axe. Second one. And get some jungle logs and especially jungle saplings are going to be super useful. Yeah. Going to need those eventually. Okay. <laughs> yeah, we're kinda exploring already. And yeah, if you guys see a place you would want to build your colony, that is probably quite smart to know the position. Yeah. The coordinates. And you could then when on Friday the server starts, already run to the coordinate you liked and start your colony there. I suggest re-watching the stream afterwards to find it. Guys, we have to sleep, by the way. Okay, done. Okay, I got some jungle saplings, that should be fine. I got one. Okay. Continue. 3,700. Th 3, who stole my horsey? Did I steal your horsey? I did. <laughs> I'm coming back. Oh, here's your horsey. <laughs> You're going to trade? Horsey, oh, want your horsey back? What is your name? Your horsey's name? That's my horsey, horsey. I'm sorry, horsey. <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry that I mixed you up. Don't be... Chalice. Oh, there's a lot of bamboo here. Yeah. That's kind of difficult to get through. <laughs> I got stuck in the same spot. Pandas! That's literally Ooh. the first time I've seen pandas in Minecraft, by yeah, the way. Same. <laughs> we need to keep them. I've never seen pandas yet in Minecraft. Oh, oh Shirley is closer than we are, I guess. Yeah, maybe he didn't walk through the bamboo jungle. Lord, this is this is bad. <laughs> I don't even have an axe anymore. That's your axe that broke? Yeah, when harvesting trees earlier. Okay. Okay, I kinda made it through it. I made it through. Oh wow, and I almost I fell see. down the mountain here, take care. Okay, we made it. We just have to make it down here somehow. Oh, I am down. Did you jump? No. I walked down. Sorry, here, horsey. I took a different path. I jumped. <laughs> poor horsey. Poor, poor horsey. I'm sorry, horsey. I tried to land in the water. That was actually my, my actual plan. Didn't work as planned. Okay, horsey. I 
Okay, I'm going to err a little bit in this direction. Surely it's getting closer than we are. And yeah, now we are stuck in some some. <laughs> we are stuck in the swamp. First is a bamboo jungle, now the swamp. But what the fuck is this word? Okay, I I got I got through the swamp. Nice, nice. We got it. We got it. We are ahead of. Another swamp. <laughs> ah, great. great. Okay, I'm going to go here on the side. Yeah, you should stay on that side of the swamp, definitely. Ah, water. Yeah, I'm going to take the route through the swamp, uh, through the thing here. The uh, forest. And surely it's getting close. We're at 3k now. Yeah, he's cheating. He's cheating. Oh, Bob, uh, Bions of Plenty has quick sand. So we'll have to take care. Haha, <laughs> some Adams is now far behind me. <laughs> Not so far. Not that far. Not here. You got a faster horse. Don't insult horsey. I'm going to give him sugar. You're going to see. Horse is going to be at super fast. Now I can see some addons on the map again. Yeah, my horse is faster than yours. <laughs> <laughs> my horse is the most charismatic horse at least. Gotta regularly reload those chunks, though. Yeah, I'll be fine. Oops. Okay, we're getting close. Now we are at 2,500 bucks. I opti not so fine. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. I think we did, we need the uh, ammo for that one too. Damn, and the damn. Opti fine and crossover also. <laughs> I definitely love those biomes. I think we said it already around 50 times. But this looks so much better than the vanilla biomes we had on the other server. Yeah, why did we even play vanilla? <laughs> this wasn't even, even intended. It was not even intended. That is Orion's and Asher's fault. Orion's fault he set up the server, to be honest. Two thousand two hundred. I should eat. I got a banana. Yeah, it it definitely mixes well. Biomes are plenty. Yeah. True. If I hit a ravine, that would be it. And it would be kind of tragic. Dying. <laughs> and leaving horsey behind plus my backpack and stuff be double tragic who built the dot? what is dot? <laughs> when can we expect a release with the buckets? Um, relatively soon, to be honest. Um, I think the first batch release should be this week, definitely. And the request system, I would expect until the end of the week as well. The Dark Oak style, you mean? Um, yes, we are, um, 
working on a new system where builders are going to kind of prefetch resources better, are going to build, um, gather entire batches of items and not only just the next items in the hot chest. Oh, this looks pretty neat as well, to be honest, those kind of ravine-like chaffs here. Hey, I'm now 1,300 meters away only. And I guess I'm at 1,000. And the Dark Oak style was initially built by Annie, which is an Australian that is not very active at the moment anymore. She was, used to be a Patreon. Um, then I built one, two buildings of it, and since that, Kugo is taking care of it. Basically. Nine hundred blocks. We're getting close. This was the quicker than I expected, to be honest. This is all very close to where we were <laughs> earlier. Yeah. And then we went north because some Eden said we have to go north. Do you guys remember this? Do you guys remember some Eden saying we should go north to find the desert? From here? That's that's where we went north from. For everyone to remember. You know that down on the map is south. Oh, we went south. Okay. So we went south, even worse. Yeah. I, I thought we went north. No. We, we were here already. Very close. But someone said this is a good direction to go with the highest likelihood to find the desert. We did find some. <laughs> <laughs> okay, 500 blocks, I'm almost there. Are you there already, Sam Adams? Yeah, uh, 300 blocks. Oh, not so far in front of me. Kinda annoying to go through this forest here. I see some desert. Ah, oh, there we go. Now, oh, Wizzy is sleeping now. Okay, we're arriving in the desert. Neat. Yeah. No, it's only a sprint away. You can see here some Adams and the others running around. Okay. And there we are. Um, how do I... Ah, that's the map type I want. Yes, better. Um, I think this looks like a pretty neat place, actually. But the river. Let me just check these things out. Now that's a temple Wizzy raided, not we. The temple we guys raided is 6,000 blocks in the other direction. I am thinking about maybe setting up a colony maybe inside this area here. But let's see. I'm going to mark this here as a possible colony spot. New spot one. There we go. See, everything here is quite flat in general. Yeah, not as mountainy as the other one. Um, this is where the desert ends, basically. 
Although there seems to be a little river at least. Yeah. Um. Um. The nice dark oak biome, so we don't have to worry much about that then. Oh. And yeah, here's the river. That seems to go into a bigger river delta here. That is though not big enough for decent chance of pirates anyway. Mm, maybe. And I was going to suggest making the colony here. In this area here where we have it kind of a little bit surrounded by those. Maybe on the top of this, you know. Yeah. Have some buildings down here, some buildings up there. Yeah, it's not bad. Where was the spawn again? Yeah, pretty close. Sure, we we'll see. Where's the spawn? And that's actually... Yeah, I think Kugu is relatively close to here too. Um, yeah, I would say we stay here. Close to this chasm here. Yeah, I think it's fine. Looks like a good spot to start. Okay, um... We do need a supply camp, that is. I have one. Uh, do you have a supply camp? Yeah, I found one. Okay. Come up here. And we... Maybe we place it down there, to be honest. Okay. Wait, I can invite you, I think. Yes, invite me to the... Yeah. Yeah, that cave might be a good starting base as well. Good idea. <laughs> I'm already being shot at <laughs> out of there. I don't have torches. Did I, I didn't get the coal either. Okay, yes. Oh, wow. This is messed up. <laughs> so oh, I guess um, Opti not so fine with this texture pack. Not <laughs> not working. No, it looks horrible. No. Yeah. Well, for me, it looks fine. <laughs> the the banner looks fine here. Um, we want the the the, the desert one. The space wars one, to be honest. I have just to reload? Ah, that's possible. I didn't restart after loading the shader. That's a chance, yes. Space Force. Yes. Wait. That looks... doesn't seem to be desert. The sandstone one? The Space Force one? It is yeah. the... the Shava desert style. Yeah. <laughs> it looks like your builds. Uh, you have to, you know it. No, place it to the desert one, the sand, the uh, Java one. That one is boring. Yeah, that one was boring. Um, I think we could, uh, yeah, just approve it. Maybe uh, it works. You know that we have to clear the area. <laughs> no, it should work in the plants. Just. Yep. Oh. Yeah. Nice. Yeah, I change it that it doesn't care about grass. Yeah, I love it. It's the Java. <laughs> Even with the robots outside. That one was creative, yeah. John. Build tool and town hall. Red wool and wood inside here. Book shelves. 
bed, butcher, some food. It actually, it definitely looks nice. It's a, a neat starting base, definitely though. Right. Let me get my shears. So we're going to be able to use this space here as additional base space here. There we go. Going to mine those here. Yeah, I just looked behind the wall <laughs> and found it. Oh, I can't mine block of gold with a stone pickaxe. Fail? Did you kill I mined one only. Accidentally. Yeah, I need an iron one. Um, I did find some coal here earlier. Did I get it? I didn't, I think. Yeah, that's useful. Making some torches out of this one here. There we go. Placing a torch here. Yeah. At least gold is not so... important. But we don't have a mesa biome close by here, right? Mm, no, we don't. I bet we have waystones close to the uh, red sand. Yeah, we activated some there. So that should be fine. Um, I guess that is a perfect moment to wrap up our stream here. So we, we're quite ready to start getting some resources and placing down afterwards our data sea supply camp, the Java Space War supply camp. Oh yes, if you could put the leads in our uh, horses, that would be nice. I think the other horse is upstairs here on the mount. I'm going to bring it down quickly. Um, I think it's quite neat moment to end the stream. Uh, this was a quite successful two hours, <laughs> but we found a very neat spot for our colony, I believe. Relatively close to spawn, which is also useful. Okay, here you go. Um, we blame Wizzy and some add-ons for walking around for hours. Wizzy could have told us earlier about this desert, right? <laughs> just provoking him. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Um, yeah, but it turned out quite nicely. We we saw we saw a, little, a lot of the different biomes, so at least we we're not going to have like feel. We we yeah, it's very good. A, a neat introduction for everyone for our server. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed our little adventure today. And tomorrow we're going to start with our getting a little bit of resources, and then we're going to start placing the stuff we need for our colonies. So the server is going to open on Friday for all patrons as well. So this time we're not only playing among our the developers, but we're playing with all patrons as, as well. Um, thanks a lot everyone for tuning in. And I'm going to see you guys tomorrow, hopefully. Thank you, good night. And don't f forget to follow and subscribe or become a Patreon to support our projects. Thanks a lot, everyone. Ciao, ciao, and good night.